Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. In today's video, I'll be showing you how to sell your domain on Flippa in 2023. Flippa is a popular online marketplace where you can buy and sell domain websites and online businesses. If you have a domain name that you're no longer need or want to sell for profit, Flippa is a great platform to connect with potential buyers. So let's dive into the process of listing and selling your domain on Flippa. So make sure to stick by. Let's dive right into it and let's get started. Before we start with this video, make sure to watch it from now till the end so you have full experience. First, we'll have to go and sign up for a Flippa account. To do so, go and open whatever browser you're going to use to follow this tutorial steps with. Here in my case, I'm actually going to use the Brave browser and of course in your case you can use any other browser that you could possibly have. Once you do so, make sure to go to the CRL section, simply type flippa.com or flippa.com and hit the enter button. Once you do so, this should take you to the home screen or main screen of Flippa website or Flippa. So, of course, from here, you'll have to go and sign up for a Flippa account, as you said. So, if you don't have an account already, you'll have to go and visit the website and sign up. Uh, you will need to provide, of course, while signing up your email address and create a password to get started. As you can see, you will have an option to log in into your account if you have an account at the top right corner. But if you don't, you'll simply have to click on sign up to create an account for yourself. Of course, if you're not sure that you want to use this, you can scroll down, read more information about it, see the listing of people, and etc. So for me, I'm just going to click on sign up, as you can see here. And as you can see, it's pretty simple. You can sign up with even your Google if you don't want to go through all the boring steps of creating or even logging into your account. As you can see, if we click on here on sign in, we'll be able even to sign in with Google. So for me, I'm just going to sign up or create an account with Google, which will let me do that very easily and very Best. So here, as you can see, so here you can simply answer those questions. You can see what you're looking to do here on Flippa or how do you think you'll use Flippa. So an example, we said that's what we're going to sell. So check this company name. It's just optional, of course, but you can type it here. Uh, the location, of course, make sure to enter your location. Then simply enter your phone number here. And where, where did you hear or how did you hear about Flippa? You can simply go and choose one of those options or click on other if you don't want to answer. Then simply Check this option you can see by creating a Flippa account. I agree to the Flippa terms and condition, privacy policy, and cookies and tracking policy. So make sure to read all of them if you don't want to have any problem with them in the future if you worry about your privacy or something like that. And as you can see, and to receive marketing emails, so you can unsubscribe for this marketing emails afterwards if you want to. So for me, I'm just going to click on create my account here. And here we are. As you can see, we have our account now. So what we'll have to do, of course, once you're logged into your account or just created your account, you'll have to go and list your domain. How can you do that? By simply clicking on sell now, where you'll find it again at the top right corner. Here you'll find the sell now option. If you click on sell uh, here, simply, once you click on sell now, as you can see, sell with the first team in Marketplace Globally, Flippa combines expert advisory with the world leading matching technology to ensure you'll sit in the fastest time for the best price at the lowest fees. So as you can see, if you scroll down here, you'll read more information about this if you want to. For us, we're just going to click on sell now right away. And of course, once you do so, you will be at the same page, but if you are not, make sure to go and click on that. And if you are at this page, you will be great. So what you will have to do simply now is simply enter your URL to sell your business. As you can see, you will have to use the URL for your site, store, app, channel, online business, or domain. For me, I'm just going to do so as an example. So let's just go and enter that and simply click on continue. As you can see, that looks like a website or domain. Choose below, whatever is that. So it's a domain, of course. And as you can see, this is a domain. Which industry do you operate in? Simply, you'll have to go and choose. For me, I'm just going to do, I don't know, internet, why not? And you can even refine your industry as... Uh, as SEO, why not? And I'm just going to click on continue for you. Make sure to enter accurate stuff. I'm just doing like random stuff here. And which of these products do you use? Check any that apply on the next screen. You will be asked some details. So if you use Google Analytics, check that. If you don't, check the others. So I'm just going to check the others here and click on continue. And as you can see, data integration. So integration makes it easy to create your lesson based on your selection. We have no suitable integration at this time, but we have recorded your selection and will notify you when a new relevant integration becomes available. So for me, I'm just going to click on continue. Basically, what we'll have to do here is simply uh, finish all those steps here on this left panel, as you can see from here. So set up integration, finances, marketing, about, media and attachments, review and set your pricing, then listing package, verify ownership, check out, and you will be good to go. 
So here, the expense name, you'll have to go and enter that, then simply enter the average cost. So I'm just going to put here 20 and I'm just going to type here test. You can add any other expense if you want to. Click on continue here. Financials, uh, financials of course, uh, select all that apply. So just domains here. And as you can see, there it's registered in GoDaddy. Yeah, that's true. Will you provide post sale support? No. Uh, uh, so you will answer questions and provide guidance once the sale completes. If you want to, make sure to do yes. If you don't want to, click on no and click on continue here. And as you can see, add any social media account if you have some. And if you don't want to, you can simply click on continue and that will not make any problem. You can always go back if you click here on marketing and you can simply enter as it seems here. So you'll have to do facebook.com slash your name or your username. Same for Instagram, uh, Twitter, uh, Pinterest, TikTok, YouTube, or you can even here enter the number of the email subscribers that you have. For me, I'm just going to click on continue or let's just do like email marketing. I'm just going to do here like, I don't know, this number, random number here and click and continue so you need some inspiration as you can see you can generate a description using ai because here you'll have to enter your description so if you look on generate a description as you can see so they can simply enter or uh, write for your description so you can see uh, this domain is dynamic business employing modern technologies to provide innovative solutions and services for various industries simply delete those last and those at first and you will be good to go without any problems as you can see a summary briefly describe what you're selling and uh, 160 characters of course if you want you can use this uh, ai and simply after that modified so as you can see how to send out why you can scan this section quickly you'll need to grab this their attention include only your most impactful e selling points so this is the summary in here of course you'll have to fill the description once you click on this option at the top right corner this will fill not just your your summary even your description as you can see it's filled automatically you can of course now read it and change whatever you want on it you can even do some designs on your text then simply click on continue and what you'll have to do here is just add some media attachments as an example for me i'm just going to click on continue i'm not going through this as an example and here you are the little scene is almost ready to go suggested price is zero dollars because i'm not filling those like with accurate stuff what's for you of course you'll have like your price there you want to have this auction or asking price to be dependent on whatever you want as example asking price i'm just going to put here twenty dollars click on continue and here you are so once you do so you'll have to select a package and all those packages you can see just one time fee so we'll not have to pay it to pay that every time you list something here so go and do that depending on whatever feature you want then simply click on continue of course i did not add anything so let's just add this as an example and here you will have to go and continue to check out to pay for the package that you choose and of course you will be after that good to go so enter your credentials here pay for that and as we said you'll be good to go so you'll have your list in there. You'll have to wait for someone until it's buy it and you'll be good to go. So if you reach this point of this video, congratulations, you've learned how to sell your domain on Flipbind 2023. So if you like this video, make sure to leave a like down below. Subscribe for our channel for more helpful tutorials like this one. And I'll see you in the next video.